Now, behind me is a man who does not need an introduction here in Mongolia, Mr. Genghis Khan. Now, let me tell you something. The food here in Mongolia is next level. Probably one of, the, one of my favorite countries I've ever been in regards to food. So, I'm now going to show you what a typical meal looks like here in Mongolia and a typical meal that Mr. Genghis Khan and his army would have eaten all those years ago. So, yeah, follow me. The restaurant is down here. Hopefully, it's going to be a good one. Let's do it. So the restaurant is literally next to the Genghis Khan statue. It's here. It's called Nomads Chain of Restaurants. Here we go. I've read online, it's your typical Mongolian restaurant. Savano. And here we go. Ooh, it is nice. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow, this is it. You can feel the culture just walking around. What a place. Right. Let's find a table up here. Now let me show you what the menu looks like here. This is your typical Mongolian menu. Every dish is, honestly, it's insane how good the food is here. So let me show you the prices and basically what type of food you can get here. Boom, look at that. Quality meats, quality vegetables, and all of these dishes are like a tenner, like 10 to 15 pounds, $20. You can't fault it, can you? Look at this. Excuse me? Hello. Are you looking for Mongolian food? I am, please. Can you suggest anything? I'm struggling. Yeah, I can recommend you some food. Okay. Anything you recommend? Uh, let me look at the menu. Thank you. I'm struggling here. You work here? Ah, uh, no. No? Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Must have seen me making a video then. Yes. I'm just trying to have lunch. Alright, what's this? Uh, you should try this one, Mongolian dumpling. Okay, I'll get that, no problem. Mm -hmm. Anything and, else? Uh, see. Oh, this one. Blimey, lamb what? Head. Lamb head? Yes. The head of a lamb? Yes. Blimey, okay. Let's do that. Do you want to join me? Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, what's your name? My name is George. George, sit down, George. My name is Ben. Thank you for having me. Yeah, no problem. Right, there we go. Let's get lamb head and some dumplings, right? Yes. Good man. Well, there you go. George has just randomly joined me, and we're now getting some lamb head and dumplings, right? Yes. Dumplings. That is Mongolian hospitality. They want you well fed in this country. So yeah, let's uh, let's order this, and yeah, I don't know what to expect. Lamb head, blimey. What do you do here in Ulaanbaatar? Uh, I'm an English teacher. Okay. So you must have heard me speak in English. Yes, that's why that's you came why. over. Yes. Nice. That's why I came. I thought you might need some help. Yeah, I do need some help. Thank you. Bye, Claire. Hey Ben, try Mongolian milk tea. Try the milk tea. Mhm. Mm okay. Mongolian milk tea. This is from a cow. Yes. But in the south, they have it from like a horse, right? Mm, we don't use horse milk to make milk tea. We okay. Use, we use uh, goat milk. Or sheep milk Go or milk. cow. So this is cow milk. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Ooh, it's sour, salty. It's salty. Uh -huh. That is way different to a British cup of tea. Look how milky it is. Look, look at that. Bye, Claire. What is this, George? Mongolian dumpling. Looks very fatty. Mm -hmm. Right, George has insisted I go first. So this is a dumpling. Your typical looking dumpling, you see them all around Asia. And some fatty meat at the top, very fatty meat. So I've got some here. Look at that. And that is the dumpling. Let's see if this is another great meal here in Mongolia. Ready, George? I'm going in. Yeah. Okay, I'll mm. show you how. It's good. Dumpling. Show me how it's done, mate. So Mongolians, we grab and. Oh, straight in. Mm, very well. It's good, mate. Wow, look what's just arrived, mate. That is the sheep head, right? Lamb mm -hmm. head. Oh my god. And there's brain in there? Uh huh, yep. Yeah. Wow. Well, here we go. Lamb head here in Mongolia. This is what Genghis Khan would have been eating back in the day. A nice, mm -hmm. strong, solid meal. So, George, do the honors, mate. How do I even start here? Uh, you should have a day uh, cut. The meat into small pieces so you can just uh, have some and eat. 
Okay. Got, got a little spoon thing here. Yeah? Here, you go first. Show show the Brits how it's done. I'll take one piece from here. Oh my god. Some veggies. And this is tongue. Tongue? Yes. Oh my god. So literally everything from the head. Yeah. This is the ear. That's the ear? Yeah. Blimey. Looks just like this. Right. What is that? That's the ear? This one. Oh, the cheek. Cheek. Right. So it's literally everything. Tongues, brain, everything you can think of from the head is in that bowl. Right. You go first, mate. What are you going to go for? Bit of tongue? Let me start from the tongue. Right. Good luck. Mm. It's good. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. Soft. Mm -hmm. What do you recommend, mate? Uh, I, I go think for? the skin first. Skin? Yep. That's uh, rich of color, full of color again. Mm. Very fatty. Mm -hmm. Oh, what is this? Uh, just the the meaty part of the head. Meaty part of the head. Yes. Meat, skin, fat combined all together. Oh my God. Very fatty as well. Mm -hmm. Very juicy. Yeah. That's good. That's good. Wow. Now, now you can try the tongue. Okay. I love me some tongue. Yeah. There you go. That's the tongue. Yep. Hmm. That is good. Mm -hmm. That's very good. Ah, uh, try the cheek. The cheek? Yeah. Oh, sorry. There we go. So that's the cheek. Mm hmm. That's the best one so far. That's the best one. My least favorite would be the skin. Mm -hmm. Then the tongue's the best, second best, and then the cheek is number one. I like that. How about ears? The ear? Yeah. All right, let's try the ear. Oh my God, very fatty. Well, here goes nothing. The ear of the lamb head. It's extremely fatty, mm -hmm. like it's almost impossible to bite into. I don't think I can eat that one. I'll be honest, mate. I'll be straight up honest. What have you got here? So next part. Eye. The eye. That's the eye? Yes. Holy shit. That is the eye. Mate, do the honours. You can go first. Mm -hmm. You got a hardcore Mongolian. Yeah. The eye. Oh my god. And then this, where the part I'm holding is the cover. Yeah. The skin. And then the white, round shaped thing is the eye. You're going all in, the straight eye in. It's just like this. Oh my god, yeah. That is a full blown eye. Good luck, mate. And there you go. Now I can eat the whole eye. Good? Mm, it's good. Blimey. What about the um, pupil? Are you going to eat that? Uh, no, we can't eat that. You don't eat that? Yes. Why not? Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> it's not meant to. Yeah. Jesus. George has insisted that I eat the eyeball. So, when in Mongolia, you've got to try it. There we go, I've got the eyeball. I'll be, I'll be honest, mate. This is going to be tough. Oh man, I can't eat that. I'm sorry, I just can't. It's too fatty, mm -hmm. you know? You should try the meat. Ah, uh, give that here. Is that the cheek? Mm. Mm. Turn out what's time. Really good. Right guys, we're gonna smash this meal. No doubt George is gonna eat most of it. But my favorite, cheek. Um, tongue was good as well, love me some tongue. The ear, not too keen on the ear, I'll be honest. I'm not too keen on the eye. But the rest of it's fine. I'm gonna have a couple more dumplings. Have some more of this uh, beef that came with the dumplings. And yeah, overall a solid meal here again in Mongolia. This is why the Mongolians are tough, hardcore people. They eat everything of like the body of this lamb. So 
Yeah, cheers to Mongolia. There you go, my stomach is full of lamb head. We ate everything you could possibly think of. I thought there'd be brain, but there wasn't any brain in there. But we tried ear, we tried tongue, cheek, you name it, the eye. But yeah, that was decent. George, thank you, mate, for showing me around. Thank you, and, thank uh, you for having me. Yeah, not, not a problem. And thank you for uh, introducing me to lamb head. I've pretty much tried every meal now you can think of here in Mongolia. I'm now gonna walk around with George up here, maybe get a beer, and yeah, gonna end the video here. Hope you enjoyed it, and when you come to Mongolia, you know what to eat. So yeah, see you later.